Hello my sky friends, I'm so happy that you're watching this video and in this video you will know something new about Germany. As you know, nowadays there are a lot of restrictions to travel, but still we have the opportunity to do it. And now in this video I want to share with you the main rules how to enter Germany. In this video I want to introduce you the most beautiful city in Germany. For me it's Cologne. Today together we will walk, enjoy the weather, we'll see the most important city sites and we'll eat the local food. Let's start! Finally I got the city center of this beautiful city and now you can see the main shopping square. As you can see today this area is super crowded because it's Saturday and it means that on Sunday all shops in this city will be closed, I mean like in the whole Germany. Today people are walking, shopping and enjoying this day and the day is super beautiful and warm, it's about 25 degrees. For September it's really good weather. Now I'm approaching the main city side of this beautiful city and as you can see in front of me there is a Köln Dome. It's a super beautiful and magnificent building. This beautiful Catholic cathedral is Germany's most visited landmark and before pandemic time about 20,000 people visited this place every day. In front of the cathedral I found this beautiful picture, it's made by the man, you can see that he's sitting in the street and painting with colorful chalks. To be honest, all people who see it are really impressed. Now I want to get closer to this beautiful gothic architecture, it looks amazing outside and for sure inside it looks also beautiful. Let's go in to check how it looks. Nowadays, you will not be allowed to visit these kind of places without negative PCR test or COVID pass. As you can see, two of these people are checking exactly these documents. Finally, I'm inside and the first thing which you see is high ceiling. And to be honest, this building from inside looks even bigger. What a beautiful mosaic and the light from outside make this cathedral even more holy. As you can see, the cathedral is crowded with people, all of them are wearing masks and they have COVID pass or negative PCR test. As you can see, there are a lot of benches, people come here on Sunday and enjoy the church service. All icons, candles and interior details make this cathedral really special. And now I offer you to keep silence and to walk, continue walking and enjoying these beautiful views. And now let's talk about the rules how to enter Germany. The first rule which you have to follow is to have passport with visa or without. It depends on the country where you originated from. People who are not vaccinated are also allowed to enter Germany, but with you you should have 72 hours negative PCR test. It took about 20 minutes to check how the cathedral looks from inside and now I'm on the way to leave this holy place and I will continue walking. Let's go! I decided to quench my thirst with this cocktail. It's a mango maracuja cocktail and there are some balance on the bottom of this cup. Now I'm on the way to the main river of the city. It's called Trine River and this river is super long. I need to tell you that I'm really surprised by today's weather, it's about 25 degrees, it's the middle of September and it feels like it's summer. To be honest, for me in Germany the weather is super strange, in August it was about 13 degrees, it was raining for two weeks and today in September it feels like it's summer. Now I'm approaching very lively place, as you can see all cafes are busy and as I told you before, today is Saturday and all tables are occupied. People are sitting enjoying the day, they are drinking beer and for German people it's normal because today it's weekend. How beautiful these colorful houses, I really like German architecture. Finally, I reached the Rhine River and if you want to see how beautiful the city is, I really advise you to take the river cruise. These river cruises are very popular among tourists and they are scheduled every 30 minutes. There on the ship you can enjoy beautiful views of Köln city and of course you can buy some drinks. 
Despite the fact that it's super warm today, there are a lot, a lot of yellow leaves on the ground and summer is leaving us. As you can see, all benches like all cafes are occupied, people are everywhere and I really admire these beautiful colorful houses. In front of them there are a lot of cafes which are also occupied. To be honest, now I don't mind to take a glass of cold beer and enjoy the sunny weather, but I need to find a place for me. Like in all old parts in this city in Europe, there are a lot of narrow streets. I really like to walk here because inside sometimes you can find beautiful unique cafes and small shops with special goods. For sure here you can find some shops where you will buy souvenirs or magnets or any kind of things which will remind you about this trip to Cologne city. As you can see there are some cafes where you can stop just for drinks, no food, it's really popular in Europe, especially in German. And you can see that people are walking, they are eating some street food, they are talking. As you can see today, the weather is super good. That's why there are a lot of people in this day. Today is a holiday and all German people relax and enjoy the sun. Let's continue walking and enjoy this day and I'm a little bit hungry. I want to eat. I need to find a special place where I can eat German food. I think you know that this city is popular for its carnival. It takes place in February and lasts about one week. People get dressed into different characters. Sometimes it can be famous, sometimes it can be crazy characters. But people have fun. They are walking in the street and some people uh, give them candies. But in the middle of the city, sometimes it's dangerous because a lot of drunk people gather here. Now I want to present a really popular German bakery and as you can see there are a lot a lot of people in LA who wants to buy something. To be honest it's so good to make a small stop after a long walking and to enjoy the sip of coffee. But coffee is not coffee without bread. Bread is a really popular pastry in Germany and I want to enjoy it.